My name is Slava, and I'm opening Twiggy in Novosibirsk, a London cocktail bar for elegant people. Its philosophy sounds like elegantly wasted or elegantly wasted time. This bar is meant for those who can afford to waste a little bit of time because the rest of their time just can't be wasted. Not even a second. But even when they waste their time, they do it elegantly. And where do you think I'm searching for inspiration? Exactly, in London. Incredible mix of everything in inimitable proportions. Just like a good cocktail, is a mixture of flavors, scents, light, time and impressions. People in the most outstanding and unusual spots in London, who are known as the best in the world bar business, will prepare cocktails for me, for Twiggy and for you of course. Eric, the trendiest bartender. Savoy Hotel. Guests are usually brought here by Rolls Royce cars, but it's Saturday. That's why my Rolls Royce is in the garage. I'll take a walk. Hemingway and Fitzgerald had cocktails in American bar at these very tables. Some guy with the name Guccio Gucci walked here as a dishwasher. Have you ever heard of him? Eric is a man in charge here today, and he's definitely not a dishwasher. Hi Eric. Hey, how are you? It's great. How are you? It's very good. Can I make you one uh, bourgeois society? Yeah, sounds cool, sounds cool. Let's do that then. To describe how cool he is, it's enough to say that he was the one teaching bartenders how to show off for the latest bomb movie, Skyfall. I think it's a dream job. After long negotiations and personal requests, Eric performed a heroic effort to arrive in about 9 in the morning after a Friday night shift just to make his special cocktail for us and tweak it. Hello from Savoy, my name is Eric Lorenz and I'm going to prepare for you my cocktail which was created specially for Twiggy. So when I thought about Siberia, I thought about Novosibirsk, I really wanted to bring some drink which would uh, want to warm you up and make you more friends. Mm. So keep walking towards the friends, <laughs> right? So which I think is very important in a bar because bar is the one of the greatest place where people can socialize mm -hmm. and make new friends, mm -hmm. right? So I'm going to start off with Angostura bitters, which gives me a very nice deep nose to it. And slightly fruity notes, I'm going for dry orange curacao, mm -hmm. which is very common used in many classic cocktails. So I'm using like 50 milliliters of dry orange curacao. Mm -hmm. And as the second ingredient, I went for a Dubonnet, which is a French aperitif wine based with different herbs and spices, and also some coffee beans. And coffee beans give me the nice almost like a chocolatey character or coffee character which I really need and I want to reflect in the drink. So I'm going to add 50, 30 milliliters of that to Bonnet. Mm -hmm. And uh, the last ingredients, but not least, mm -hmm. is the Tony Walker Black Label. So that works really well with the with the uh, Dubonnet and orange curacao. So it's got a very nice smoky flavor and the coffee beans comes up there and also the logic just, just showing the British character this yeah, yeah and I'm just gonna stir it yeah, yeah it's a uh, glass exclusively made for the American bar so mm -hmm. we've got lots of glass here which uh, mm -hmm. were bespokely mm -hmm. created for the American bar so I'm just gonna turn it into the glass mm -hmm. But I'm going to keep uh, just, uh, a medium size cube there. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm going to finish it with uh, a zest of orange, just to give this nice fresh citrus orangey notes. Mm -hmm. There we go. That's appealing. Thank you. Here we go. The first recipe for Twiggy, Bourgeois Society traditional and brutal combination of scotch whiskey, Johnny Walker Black Label and sophisticated French liquor with personal stamp of the trendiest guy in London. So that's my bourgeois society for two year. To be continued.